Have your audio ready. Right click it, convert audio to keyframes. Click U on your keyboard and select the keyframes for both channels. Begin marking the beats. I usually mark one frame before the highest peak. Have your intro clips ready and trimmed according to the beat marks. Select tracker and then stabilize motion. Copy what I do. The inner square should be the size of the object. The nose in this case, the outer square could be as large as you want, as long as it doesn't take too long. Of the larger it is, the smoother the tracking. Scale the clips and change the position to bring the head as close as possible to the center without it looking weird. You don't have to add motion tile if there is minimal black borders, but I usually do it just in case. Add frame blending and motion blur. The head changes from a side to another, add position keyframes to cancel that out. Pre-compose the clips. I use a script that does all three at once. It's available in my Discord server. Add Twixter Pro. I prefer it more than the ordinary one. Copy the settings. keyframes I use for speed. For this Twixter, I easy ease, but don't alter the graphs. Add S, Blurmo curves to the clip. Copy the keyframes I use for Z, Dist. I use 0 0.39 to 1 here. Copy the graph on the flow extension. Once you're done with all the clips, pre-compose, then add panning and RSMB like this. 